Tesla produced uh, about 256,000 cars and SUVs last year. Uh, it sold roughly 245, a little more than 245. Um, there's about a 9,300 uh, vehicle difference. So it produced more vehicles than it, than it delivered. And some analysts are concerned that that coupled with Tesla's move to cut prices by $2,000 on each of its three models, that that's uh, an indicator that the demand might not be there anymore and there might not be as many people interested in their product and therefore um, there could be some problems down the road. In some cases, we found, uh, in one case in Chicago, uh, there were a lot of Teslas, probably 70 to 100, stacked up on a lot on the north side of Chicago. Uh, that was at the end of last year. Um, and that was an indication, too, that industry that the inventories were starting to grow. That Tesla is saying that uh, that was a lot used to store uh, vehicles that might be in transit from the plant in California uh, to other areas such as New York uh, on the East Coast and that they're stored there temporarily. Tesla says that the uh, vehicles uh, at that lot are lower now than they were at the end of the year when we did the uh, video there. They're kind of at a crossroads now. Um, that's what the analysts are telling me. Um, they either have to decide whether they want to cut production uh, to limit the supply or to cut their prices um, to stimulate demand and get more sales. And Tesla's kind of at a crossroads there now, and it's not clear what exactly the company is gonna do.